That was one of the most unbelievable performances I've seen. Anthony Joshua is the baddest man on the planet, and I'm telling you now, he beats everyone in the division. You know it. You know it. You know AJ's the best heavyweight in the world. He is back, baby. AJ is the good and the future undisputed heavyweight world champion. It's not rocket science. The best man will always win. Sat here, that's how I'm feeling. You know, I'm gonna take some time to rest, come back. Assalamu alaikum. Keep your head high. Don't let this discourage you. You know, don't let success get to your head and you should never let failures get to your heart. Don't be discouraged and um, I respect you. So in fact, I didn't feel the punch. But I don't feel any pain. That's how I know I was knocked out. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Performance of the night, $50,000. Congratulations. Sir, I love you. That was a vicious knockout. I had nothing to do with what happened in there tonight. I mean, listen, the crossover, you know how I feel about crossovers and the boxing, and that's, that's how they end, just like that. Going into the Fury fight, if Fury trained for the fight and didn't show up and, you know, look like he ate Tyson Fury, it's probably the way that fight would have ended, too. Shut your mouth for a smack it in. Francis Ngannou beat the WBC heavyweight champion of the world. I should be the WBC heavyweight champion of the world. Shut up, you big sausage. Let's go, AJ. I want the fight. I want the fight next. He's a big bum dosser. I'll knock him out inside three rounds. <laughs> He's mad. Pop top, did he pop, pop, pop? When he caught him, he caught, when he caught, caught. And he go, did he throw it in your pop? I'll process it and then uh, see what is the next step. But uh, you can be sure that I'm not done here. Absolutely not.